guys, welcome back to JNJ Beekeeping. We just found a window in the weather where it's warm and sunny enough to do a hive inspection. What we're really looking for in the hive inspection is the queen, the queen laying, or very new eggs. We're also looking for the bees expanding as in drawing, as in drawing out comb or putting in stores. We would also like to put on a super today as it will give, as it will give the colony more room to expand in. So come on dad, let's light our smoker. Okay, Jake. Okay guys, we've just finished lighting our smoker, so we're going to just put a, a few puffs across the entrance to get the bees to get the bees back into the hive. Another couple, Jake, do a couple more. Okay. Big puffs. Perfect. That's there it, that's enough. Go. And and then we take off the roof. Let's put that to the side. Okay. Hang on Jakey, leave that there and I will just lift this up for you quickly. A couple of puffs underneath yep. when I lift this. Yep. Okay, puff all the way across. And in, and we'll just put that down for a couple of seconds. Is that there right? We go. Yep, 100%. Just take off the. Okay, Jake, no yet. problem. Mm -hmm. Just maybe one or two more puffs. One, two. There we go. So they seem to have gone down nicely, Jake, I'm haven't they? So we really want to try and find evidence that the queen is here, even if we can't see her. We want to see new eggs or larvae. We want to yes, see the queen is laying. That is exactly what we are looking for. So that's one frame with nothing in it. Yep. Which is okay. Completely fine. Uh, Another frame with nothing in it. So it looks like they haven't been drawing much, many of the frames out at all, Jake. So that's now we're going to start getting into the bees now, Jake. Yep. So they've started drawing out, if you can see everybody, and Jake, this side there's nothing on it. This is just a clean, unused foundation. Yep, and then... And here the bees are drawing out the foundation quite nicely. Yes. Can you see a queen on there, Jakey? Um, I will look. There won't really be any reason for the queen to be out on this frame, because there's not really much good places to lay, because the um, frames haven't been fully drawn out yet. So okay, so we're just going to move yeah. this. We'll keep all these bees inside to disrupt yeah. them as little as possible. So pull it back away first. That's it, slowly, in case the queen, she could be on this one. So they've drawn out two frames. So I think we might put the super on today, just to give them loads of space, because they seem to be this expanding. Really keep, keep it over the box, just in case anything drops. So there's nothing on this side. So if I just carefully it over there are a lot of bees on this side and so they've drawn out properly drawn out two and they're starting to fill yeah. up that so I there's no queen on there as well queen. so we're now into the territory Jake we might spot a queen in here we're looking for I this we're in. looking for this blue colored dot okay now can you do a couple of puffs of smoke across the top yep, for I me will. gotta be really really careful here so there's plenty of activity anyway, Jake. Yep, I'm just going to... I'll just spin the frame, the frame this way and we can both see it. Uh, oh, there's a yellow, that, see the yellow dot in the bottom oh. right corner, the bottom right oh, corner. Yeah, I see it, yeah. We were led to believe it was a blue, but if on the bottom, bottom corner, guys, bottom left as you're looking at it, coming up, just hold where my finger is here, Jake. Okay, wait, yeah. Oh, can you hold that? Um, I'm going to point to the queen there. There, look at that, nice yellow dot. So we'll have to. Yep. Very I thought it was a. Okay, let's put that, put that bit down yeah. here. Uh, okay, I'll grab that. Now we just want to check. Where has she gone? So she's there. Now we want to start looking for eggs. Yes. Now I can see loads of eggs, Jake. Really? Okay. Yeah, if you look into the middle of that, yep. into those cells, there's loads of little um, white dots, yeah? Okay, can you see? Oh yeah, I see them. Yeah. You It'll won't see this on the camera, but there's lots of little white dots, lots of eggs, just around this section where the yep. queen is. I'm see if I now Jake, can you see where that, where did the queen disappear to there? Um, it probably went under. Here it is, she's on this side. Oh, okay. Okay, so... We're happy. She's she's there. She's laying eggs. Probably won't be any larvae on this side yet. Once she's laid an egg, then three days after that, it turns into a larvae. So if we move to this frame here, 
racing chair for today. I think I'll be all right, Jakey. Uh, yeah, give it a give it a prize it out without a bit. Um, so that if she was on this frame. Ah, oh, well done. There we go. Okay, hold this. Here. Maybe a maybe a few. There's a lot of okay. The stores frame. here. They're making. We'll turn that round. I see a lot of sealed brood. Lots of honey stores there on the it's top also section. Also, a good amount of sealed brood on there. And actually, well said, Jake. Yeah, below that, the yellow caps, the flat caps, that sealed worker brood. Drone brood is a bit more. It comes out over the top a bit more. Yep. Now, it's what we've forgotten to look for, Jakey, is any queen cells, but we haven't. I haven't, haven't seen, seen any. one on that one. They'll they'll be really really obvious. And just a quick puff of smoke across the top, maybe. Okay. Let's just check. Dad, you take the. Um, any queen cells? We're looking at the bottom for the queen cells. I'm just going to. There's take none the on top those right ones. Here. Just across the top. 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 Thanks, Jakey. That's okay. Just about enough. Now, this might be more interesting. I can see loads of worker brood on the bottom of this oh, one, Jake. Oh, okay. See, that's all worker brood. I see brood. a queen cup developing, all being taken down. Yeah, there's a queen cup with a larvae. Wait, on this thing? Yeah, see all that? How does the one on another thing? That's loads of worker brood, loads of stores. That looks really nice. Yes, yeah. can you turn on the thing? So, that looks really nice. I just want to see if there's any queen cups. Is there queen cups? Stores around here, honey, and this is all work of brew. That looks like to us like a really nice frame, but Jake, oh, yeah. I'll just show at the bottom of that, that's all drone brewed. And there's one queen cup. I don't see it. Here. What? See? So if you could just take that, if you actually if you hold this, hold this yep. frame and give me the hive tool. Well I can't really give you the hive tool. Be careful with your fingers on the bees there. Okay. Just just hold the end. Really Actually, Jake. Yeah, I can try to do it. If you give me the hive tool and yeah. you lift that out, that's the best way. And I don't think I, we were oh, told we can just. There's nothing wrong with destroying yeah. one, but then I'm not sure if that's a queen cup or a worker brood. And I'm just going to get it's rid of it. Is that a worker brood? Uh, drone brood, was it? Yeah. I see something right there that's not really sealed. It's probably not drone brood. Okay, so let's have a good look here. Wait, there's something on the bottom. I think that's all. That's the hatchet. So we found the queen and we're happy that she's laying eggs. So we're just going to quickly move through the rest of the frames. I'm just going to probably try and take off some of the problem. Never mind. Um, We've got a man to beat lock. There's a queen Lots cell of stores. Oh uh, yeah, get the, just break that off with the hive tool, Jakey. Um, that's it, just break it off. Just a rudimentary queen cup, just a play cup they're called, so just take that off. That's it, lovely, take it off totally. I took off. Okay. Okay, so there's loads of honey and brood. So as you're looking at it, the top right and the right hand side, loads of honey stores. And the rest, all the brown, is all work brood. So this is looking it looks pretty very, good. Very healthy. And the same on this side. So loads of bees. What do you think about the super, Jake? Should we put it on? Yeah. I think we should. should. One of the a very experienced lady on our course. What did she say? Uh, super early for bees, late for honey. That's it. Super early for bees to give them space, and then late for honey. We're just checking finally. We're going to do this quickly now. Just get rid of that queen cup there, Jake. Wait, there on there, on the right-hand side. Okay. Just move that. Um, I just destroyed some That's it. One more. So we've decided we're putting a super on, have we, Jake? Yep. And it's a One nice day. The, we the weather forecast is better, so hopefully... Oh, they're building brace comb, I They're building a bit of brace comb in there, but that's okay. That's all right. I'll no, leave it. it. Wow, loads of nice honey and worker brood there. So what's going to happen everyone, the worker brood, it hatches 21 days after the egg was laid, or 19 days. So there'll be a point where suddenly this colony hopefully will, I'm excuse me Jake, to... will start really expanding quickly. Now you can leave that, you can leave that. Okay. Now I just want to move back all the frames in order. So you're happy? Yep. We have a queen with the yellow dot. Yes. Let us put them all in. 
Should we try, try and chase it? And then we're going to put the super on and call it a day, I think. We're happy enough, aren't we? Yep. We've seen lots of eggs, lots of larvae, lots of brood and stores. We've seen our queen. Okay, so just push them all a bit quicker. That's it. I can do the smoke, Jake, if you I want. I see a bee right there that's not moving. It's not going to forge. Just push, just push it. I don't want to kill the bee. Look, there's a bee right there. Okay, there you go. Um, <laughs> there you go. Push the next one in quick. That's it. And then put the empty frames on. Put the empty frames on now. You okay? Good man. There we go. So they're calm enough, aren't they? So we're just gonna... Yeah, we're just gonna put on the super. We also have a Prospex crime board, so we can like see through it. We won't be able to um, feed them through that, so we'll probably have to change the um, crime board at a later date, but... After putting this frame... Well, Jake, if I do the super... It should be... Just so it's across a bit. It should be done. That's it. Yeah, if you hold that... Sure. And I'm going to put the crown board straight on top. The crown board? The Sorry, the super. The queen excluder. It's, and there's a queen excluder under here as well. Is there? Oh. There's a queen excluder. I'm just going to spray this so that these are smooth. That's it. Across the front. Let's get as many of them. Good then. That'll do, Jake. We should be okay. We have a space at the bottom of the Queen Excluder, so we're just going to put that on like this. Uh, just slide it over. And there we go. So we got lucky. We got a weather in the window. It's been really cold and wet, and it's due to get windy and wet again so we got lucky there that's our hive inspection they have plenty of space so hopefully we won't need to visit this hive again there's no queen cups or anything any sign of swarming so we won't need to visit this hive again for a good seven days we might even leave it ten days because we're inexperienced and apparently if you do a hive inspection it can set the colony back two or three days so we're still very very inexperienced and learning so uh they probably don't enjoy a hive inspection from us too much, so we'll leave that for, for maybe seven to ten days. Okay. Thanks everyone. Thanks Jake. Was that good? Yeah.